Hey guys, my name is Dixon Liu and you are watching The Dapper Vault. In today's video, we talk about how to fold a pocket square. Let's go! Before I get into that, you may own the best tailored suits or shirts out there in the world, but if you're not wearing a pocket square, you are definitely missing out on one essential piece that every man needs to have in their wardrobe. There are only a handful of accessories that us men can wear to truly express ourselves, especially when it comes to classic menswear. And with little to no effort at all, wearing a pocket square can suddenly elevate your style without breaking the bank. Unlike ties, you can wear a pocket square for any occasion, depending on the fold. However, there are definitely a few style rules that you need to follow when it comes to pocket squares. Rule number one, never match your tie and your pocket square. By this, I mean the same color and pattern. Doing this is gonna make your outfit look tacky and it makes you seem like you have no idea what you're doing and you just went into a department store and just got a matching set. Tip number two, be sure the color of your tie complements the color of your pocket square. If you're going with a pocket square with different colors and patterns, try matching those color accents with your tie. This is going to make your outfit flow harmoniously. Rule number three, do not purchase pre-folded pocket squares. Same reason why you don't wear clip-on ties. Tip number four, show the right amount of fabric. Gents, it's all about proportions. Just like your suit jacket exposing the right amount of shirt cuff, your pocket square should reveal three quarters or an inch of fabric. Anything too little or too much is going to mess with the overall proportions in your outfit. Tip number five, only wear pocket squares with your suit, your blazer, and your sports jacket. Just because your overcoat has a breast pocket doesn't mean you need to stuff your pocket square in there. Be sure to stick by this rule, suits, blazers, and sports jackets only. Rule number six, use the right fold for the right occasion. If you're unsure, go with the presidential fold or the classic fold. The seventh and the last rule is never ever use your pocket square to blow your nose. But if you really have to, still no. All right, here are five ways to fold a pocket square. Starting with the presidential fold. Lay your pocket square flat on the table, Fold it in half from the right to the left. And depending on the size of your breast pocket, fold one third back to the right side. Use your index finger to help fold from the top to the bottom. And the last step is to fold the bottom section to the back depending on the length of the breast pocket and this is the presidential fold. Next up, the reverse puff. Lay your pocket square face up, pinch your pocket square in the center of the fabric and lift it up. As you're lifting it up, run your other hand down the length of the fabric with two fingers like so. Top three quarters of the way down and fold the bottom section up to the back and there you have it, the reverse puff. Be sure the pointy ends are peeking out of your breast pocket. Moving on, the puff fold. Just like the previous fold, Lay your pocket square face up. Pinch your pocket square on the center of the fabric and lift it up. As you elevate it, run the other hand down the length of the fabric with your two fingers. Stop three quarters of the way down and you're done. Unlike the reverse puff, the puff should reveal the folded part in your breast pocket. Next up, the three peak fold. Lay your pocket square face down in a diamond shape. Fold it in half from the bottom to the top so that two points meet. Take the bottom right point and fold it up to the top point and position it slightly askew to the left of the top point to create two peaks. Take the bottom left point and fold it up askew to the right of both peaks to create the third peak. Fold the right corner in towards the middle and repeat this step on the left side to create the cone shape. Lastly, fold the bottom section up to the back according to the length of your breast pocket and you're done. Last but not least, one of my favorite folds, the stair fold. Lay your pocket square face down, fold it in half from the top right corner to the bottom left corner so the two points meet. Create a pinch in the fabric and lift it up just below the fold line to create a pleat. Create another pinch in the fabric and bring it below the pleat you just created. With your index finger as a guide, make a fold like so and you have the stir effect. Now, just fold both the edges depending on the width of your breast pocket and fold the bottom section up to the back and you're done. So that's it guys. Five ways to fold a pocket square. 
If you learned something new today, be sure to hit that like button. Let me know down in the comments what is your favorite pocket square fold. And for more content like this, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. As always, stay dapper.